I don't know if you guys can see it, but there's a little tiny baby in there. One of my guppies is having the babies. And I'm trying to figure out which one it is. I'll be right back. Hey everyone, Elite Trainer CJ here. So, um, yes, my one of my guppies is having the babies. I'm trying to figure out which one it is. It's, it might be this one, because this one's got a big humongous belly. Could be this one. It has a big belly too. There's also one hiding in the back area, and I think that's where the babies are coming from. I'm trying to see where they're coming from, but like uh, there's one just chilling back there over by the uh, air air um, tube. Uh, it's just chilling back there because they are hiding from the uh, the adults because uh, they do. Um, eat the little baby fries, like I said in the last video that I made. Um, I think I saw at least one hiding in this little bush right here. And I think I saw the mother. Yeah, the, I think it's that yellow one, yellow tail. Or it's this one in the very back. One of them's having babies. I'm trying to figure out which one. But this is a very exciting time for me. Like, I didn't think that I could do it be a guppy breeder already but it's happening um i did make a few changes to the tank i did i lost two females so, and uh i do believe it's because i um had that grass the uh, the plants right on the top and it was preventing them to get food so i took that out and i decided to get this little bush right here and then add this bush right here so that way the babies can just hide and uh that way I can keep that top area open so they can get their food. Um, while this is going, I can also update you on um, some other things going on. So, I don't know if I can find it right now. It might be hiding in the back somewhere. Oh, I think I know which one is having the babies. Okay, I gotta move these to the side. I gotta move some of this... Uh, medication here if you look back here I have a mystery snail that is the addition I did move the assassin snails because I did get two more and I was trying to get the uh, the mystery snail to help clean up the area here because it was very dirty but I have decided to start cleaning my tank um, about every three days about twice a week um, just, just because I have a good amount of guppies in here, I just want to make sure the water is nice and clean for it. And there's the mommy right there. I think that's the one giving birth, so. There was one hiding in that bush back here. The one that can move, that's right by the, uh, pump that moves, kind of like a regular plant. So, if I find any more babies, I will let you guys know. So far, I've only seen, I think, about two babies. And, uh, it can take a while for them to give birth, but, because it is a live birth, it's not, like, laying eggs or anything. But, um, they can have in between, I think, sits and about 30 fries at a time. And I do have a few pregnant ones, like that one, and the yellow one right there. Even this, well, no, this one's not pregnant yet. But I did put some, oh, um, I did, went, I did go to the store. Oh, there's another one. Well, not baby, but I did go to the store and get some, uh, aquarium salt because that, uh, actually helps them, you know, um, get in the mood to breed, um, to, oh, I think this is the one giving birth because it's hiding. Let's see. Let's see if I can get it. Good angle of it. Any more babies in here? Not entirely sure. It's kind of hard when these air bubbles are going and all these fish swimming around trying to keep my eye on everything, but it's a very exciting time. Um, while this is going on, let's go ahead and get to the other tank. 
and uh, talked about that a little bit. And so here's my other tank. Um, I did move the Ember Tetras and the Bloodfin Tetras over here um, just so I can have one that's just uh, the Duppy tank and then um, as time goes on I will bring some of the babies over here once they're a good size. Um, it takes about 30 days for them to be a decent size to where the um, they won't get attacked. And um, right here in the corner is one of my assassin snails. Um, I have a total of three. I don't know if I can find them all, but um, one's back here. Yeah, you see it right there? Let's see. Yeah, that's just one of them. That's the reflection. And then the third one, I'm trying to find out where it is. Um, I did add this bubbler right here. And then, yeah. Um, I don't know why, but my Black Molly is loving to hang around the uh, heater. Um, I do believe, I want to say this uh, Dalmatian Molly is pregnant, so that might be a male uh, Molly, but I'm not entirely sure. This Platy started belly. Um, interesting fact also is that Mollies also give live births. Um, I don't know about, I think Platy's lay eggs, so... Um, Tetris definitely lay eggs, so, um, don't have to worry about, like, if I have males or females, I would just have to find out. I am down another glowfish, so I'm down to the one. Uh, I found the other one, like, up against this dead. Um, I don't know exactly what happened, but I've been checking the ammonia and all that. It was a tiny bit up there so I've been uh, putting some treatment in there and it seems to be doing good because the fish are hanging out being you know not really freaking out or anything they, they love the bubblers as you can see um, they love the heater but yes let's go ahead and go back to the guppy tank and let's see if we had any more babies alright so I did find one of the other babies uh, I'm not sure if it's the same baby as earlier I'm trying to find it on the phone Actually, it's right here. Let me see if I can focus in on it. You see it? The little one? The little fry? That's a baby guppy. I am excited. So, I'm gonna... I, I would assume that they would hide in this little area. Because they can hide underneath and the other fish won't swim through there. They can definitely hide in this little area right here. Um, I mean, you already saw one of them hiding in there. The mama went back over there. I think that's the one giving birth. So, all the females are trying to hang into the ground. So, maybe they're little by little. Um, I don't know exactly which fish is giving birth though. But, I still, I still don't know. But, uh, there are little tiny guys in there. So, I think I should see them. Um, let's see if I can go from above. Nope, it's a two AV. Let's see. Do, do, do. Where do you go? I see ya. He's right. He or she is right there. The little tiny yellow speck with the black eyes. Hey, little guy. Say hi to the world. Excited to be here? I can't wait to see your brothers and sisters. So it takes them about 30 days to grow to be a decent size to where the other fish won't attack them, like I said. Um, at that point, if they all survive, or if some of them survive, I don't expect all of them to survive. I, mean, I would assume that some would just venture out and then be eaten. Um, that's okay. That's why I kind of had them, all the females, in with... Uh, the rest of these guppies in here. Um, I didn't want to overpopulate. Ooh, it's swimming. I didn't want to overpopulate it, but then I still wanted some babies, and I have seen videos where you can have setups like this where they ha at least have spots to hide, and uh, they they will survive. They are small enough to where they can eat like the little tiny bacterias and all that um, that's in the water. Probably I should do thing that I'm using. Um, Right now, I'm trying to use this uh, 
Ready Start Nutrifying uh, Bacteria Starter, where it's uh, natural um, bacteria that will help uh, keep the taints from, you know, you know, where you don't have to maintenance it as much. But yes, uh, you know what? Tomorrow's video, I will show you guys. I'm gonna do a video tomorrow just to update you guys because this is exciting and I'm sure that the rest of the babies will be born by then. Um, I don't know exactly how long it takes for them to give birth to all of them, but I definitely need to clean the outside of this tank. As you can see, it's at Watermarts. I just gotta, you know, go over with like a towel. Um, maybe even invest into a scrubber for the insides right here. Uh, just to keep it clean. But yes, uh, thank you guys for watching. This is very exciting. Um, I gotta see if any of my friends want some guppies by the time these little guys grow up. See if we can find that one one more time. Might be hiding in a spot where you can't see it. Oh, I see it. I don't know if you guys can, but I'm zooming in right where it's at. Yep. See that little yellow? Alright. Do my outro for me. Hit that like button, that subscribe button, and that notification bell so that you won't see it. So that way you can uh, see more videos uh, and get the updates on my fish, on my guppy tank. Uh, I will keep you guys updated, and uh, you guys have a good one. And yeah, welcome to the world, baby guppies.